Welcome back to Carnades.org. Today we're going to be continuing our series, Dumbfounding Definitions, Dizzying Distinctions, and Diabolical Doctrines, a series sorting through some of the jargon and complicated terminology of philosophy. In this video we're going to be doubling up for a three-minute philosophy video. So, in this video we're going to be answering the question, what is modality? You may have heard of modality in other contexts, but here we're going to be looking at the varieties of modality that exist. So, modality is the study of those things that are possible and those things that are necessary. This can be metaphysical modality, epistemic or doxastic modality, nomic or natural modality, and moral or deontic modality. All of those are different kind of possible ways to look at possibility, as it were. Let's take a look. So metaphysical modality is kind of the standard notion of modality. Usually when someone's talking about a modal claim, they're talking about metaphysical or logical modality. Anything that is logically possible, that means doesn't entail a contradiction, is metaphysically possible. All the laws of math and logic are metaphysically necessary. That means they're true in all possible worlds. If something is possible, that means it's true in at least one possible world. If it's impossible, it means it's true in no possible worlds. There are a lot of different opinions on what exactly we mean by possible worlds. Are those actual worlds out there that we have no connection to? Are they just rearrangements of the actual world? Are they just modal fictions that we create? It's a subject for another series. Nomic modality. Nomic, natural, or scientific modality is a slightly more restrictive kind of modality than metaphysical modality. It deals with those things that are possible given the laws of science and nature, as well as the laws of math and logic. Those laws are true in all nomically possible worlds. Though, since it's possible that those laws were different, this is a proper subset of all possible worlds. It's smaller than the set of all metaphysically possible worlds, the set of nomically possible worlds, because there could be a possible world that doesn't have any logical contradictions but has different laws of physics. Epistemic possibility talks about knowledge. Epistemic modality or dogsastic modality has to do with what we can conclude on the based on ideal reasoning and our evidence. So given a set of evidence, what are the possibilities that I could logically conclude, what is necessary for me to logically conclude, and what is impossible for me to logically conclude. Some proposition P is epistemically necessary for a subject S if that subject can eliminate not P based on their evidence. For example, a jury might conclude that the accused is innocent based on the evidence evidence presented and their reasoning capacities. Some proposition Q is called a priori if the subject can eliminate not Q without evidence based on reasoning alone. As a skeptic, I'm worried about some of the concerns here, but we're not going to get into them now. We also have deontic ethical or moral modality. This has to do with what is morally not allowed, permitted, or obligatory. This is isomorphically mapped onto the ideas of impossible, possible, and necessary. Basically, it's impossible for you to do something that's not allowed and stay moral. It's possible for you to do something that's permitted and stay moral, but it's necessary for you to do obligatory things to stay moral. You might have a morality that would say, you must not kill people, it's not allowed, impossible. You may give to charity, it's permitted, it's possible, but it's necessary that you are honest. It maps onto these concepts of modality in interesting ways. So, there's a lot more things to learn about how different varieties of modalities do and don't line up, how possible worlds are structured, and how modal logic works. I already have a video up on modal logic if you're curious, but in the future hopefully we're going to be getting in deeper to the other kinds of modalities. Watch this video and more here at Carnades.org, and stay skeptical everybody.